Kerala Blasters Let's go Coach this side Coach So with uh, Ivan Bukumanovic, uh, Ishan Pandit and so on and Mandal over here, Ivan, we're in a bit of a reflective mood because it's the 10th season of the ISL that's uh, going to begin now. Just to start off and set the stage, could you talk to us a bit about uh, what you heard about the league before you came to Kerala last year? It's going to be your third season now in the club. What have you heard about it? How did you find it when you joined and how have you seen the league grow in the last three seasons if you could start with that? Before I throw the floor open to the general uh, Well, uh, I didn't hear a lot, I must admit, because I think that uh, ISL is not uh, uh, that popular in uh, Europe. Uh, you cannot see uh, often, you cannot see a lot of uh, images from uh, ISL. The fact that uh, every time you find yourself in a um, transfer window, approaching players, to attract them and sign to ISL, uh, they don't have a clue, they don't have an idea about ISL, they don't know nothing. And very often uh, it's very difficult when you approach those players to convince them to come and play in ISL. And maybe it is because uh, there is a huge popularity of many other leagues uh, uh, in Europe, especially around the world, and then the players they decide to try uh, to stay on uh, some other markets. And actually, you find yourself uh, very often with the with the situation where the players uh, say, you know what, let's find, uh, give me some time, uh, you know. And then at the, at the end of transfer window, actually, where they found themselves without option or something, they decide to come, which is uh, from one side not easy uh, because these players they don't get the information. And us also in Europe before I arrived in India, I didn't have a clue, I didn't have uh, that much information. But the moment we had the contact, of course. I got informed and uh, actually I remember watching all 20 games from the pre previous season to get the information, to get everything, uh, you know, for uh, for those meetings and actually then I was uh, kind of positively surprised with the level, with, uh, with everything, uh, what I found out and of course then I accepted with, uh, with a pleasure to be part of myself. So, right. that was my first impression. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Um, and Ishan, you've seen uh, the league grow from the outside, you've been to Spain previously. Uh, what were your first impressions uh, when you came and how have you seen it grow over the last uh, uh, few years when you've been involved in the league? Um, when I first moved to Spain, I think ISL was in its first season. And I remember we had lots of high profile signings and it was just a two month season. So I think we've come a very, very long way from that first season, being the 10th season now, in terms of the quality of players that we're signing, not just for for the glitz and the glamour of the league, but more to develop football in India. And I think the infrastructure is, has picked up massively compared to when it first started. And yeah, I think overall it's growing and we're going in the right direction. And yeah, there's a good future in India for football. All right, uh, sorry, I promise I'll come to you a little later, but I'll throw the floor open to the journalists over here because I'm going to have a lot of questions. Can we start with the gentleman on the left over there, please? Yeah. 